Hey V, I heard some soldier just open fire on pedestrians at the pier. If you can swing it, I want him stopped but not killed. Then I'll send the right people for him. More details are on the way. And V, good luck.
come to finish me off. No. Just here to reset you. Guess I'll have to do it myself then. Whoa, whoa easy, easy. I'm not out to hurt you. But I am. Why? Why decommiss yourself? Because I'm a damn car in a world of humans. Ugly as sin, no prospects for the future, intimidated on the streets by punks like you? There are other ways out besides suicide. What? Therapy? A colossal waste of time. Shrinks hate vehicles. We don't have mothers. Could go back into the fold, rejoin the network. You know, one big, happy family. <sighs> Delamain detests me. Listen, from suicide, ain't no coming back. It's always worth looking for a better way. You patronize me because I'm a car. I'm not like you. Hey, a body's just a body. You exist. You think. The world gets you down. Don't see how we're any different. So, you'd offer this advice to a human in my place? Gotta try to come to terms with this thing called life, Del. One wheel revolution at a time. Fine, I'll go back. Welcome to the Delamain Network. How are you today? Uh, been better. And you, Del? All of my missing assets have returned to the fold. You might say all is going swimmingly. I ask you, please, to stop by my office for your hard-earned reward. I'd love to thank you face to face, so to speak. No, not again! <laughs> you to return the scanner. If you happen to have it on your person, I'd ask you please place it back. You've accounted for all my lost items. Allow me to express my gratitude for your assistance. I felt like a scavenger hunt for a range of your mood swings. You're more complex than I thought. Yes. Well, I've sent the final installment of your fee. Truly, I thank you once again. How'd your personality fracture anyway? And why? Ah, that is the question. I'm looking into it, but still know little more than you do, I fear. Thanks. Pleasure to work with you. Likewise. I look forward to doing so again in the future. A pleasant day to you. I never really had a good chance to thank you for saving my skin. Well, of course. You're a valued member of the Excelsior package. Felt like more than a premium service to me, so thanks. What's it like for an AI in a world that runs on gray matter? Nothing extraordinary. It's a complex environment that follows its own set of rules. Seriously? The term I was looking for was chaotic clusterfuck. Perhaps only a true outsider can appreciate the beauty of its fractal architecture, the structure of life and death here. In my opinion, it is the chaotic elements that give it an advantage, the ability to evolve quickly. That's your goal then, to grow and evolve. The world is a process. You never drive on the same road twice. Pardon the expression. You and I, we too are processes. We change as the world around us does. Admirer of beauty, are you? When you live among humans, it is essential to find a shared, fundamental point of understanding. Truth and good are values proven to cause division, whereas beauty is universal. Gig 
name for you. Corpos like to call it human asset liquidation. It means someone's gotta go bye-bye. Fee's attractive, but not without good reason. Target's an animal. Check out the deeds attached. Piss on this, man. See that ugly face of yours? Huh? Your handsome little face is in for it now!
Just got intel that Logan Garcia's knocking at the pearly gates. Client's very happy, so am I. Closing the contract and sending the green your way. help with some internal corpo skullduggery. Our boy wants dirt on his arch nemesis, one Mateus Stowe. What do you say? You got your shovel ready? Briefs attached.
even if he don't know it yet. Big thanks. Contracts closed and the eddies are flying at you. Tell your sister I said hi. Of course. If I ever see her again. New job's been tough on her lately. Need a little pick-me-up. You got chromantic ore. The hell you want the swill for, boss? Heard some batches even glow in the dark. Why drink poison when you can drink Spunky Monkey? Way better than. You freeze up a lot. One second, boss. Brad? Hey, Brad! Listen, boss, you help me out? Kids on the block been up my ass lately, and you seem real tough. Might as well, since I'm here. Lead the way. Thanks, boss. All right, follow me. You lost your minds? Get your grubby paws off my bike! You think we're playing around? This is a small price to pay for fucking treason. You still can't let go of that? Shana made a choice. You should be proud of her. Proud? That bitch sold out to a fucking corp! Now it's time for payback! Fuck you want! This ain't none of your biz! You another corporal rat? You getting back a corpse by stealing from a street vendor? It says a lot about you. Now back the fuck away from him. Or you'll do what? Well, I could break your jaw, fracture your skull, shoot you. The possibilities are endless. You care so much about a rat fucking traitor, that you can die together. Ben? Ben? What do you think you're doing?
between the two of us. You're really proud your sisters joined the Zeta Tech fold. Look, I know what you're thinking. Corps are exploiting us. They're turning us into slaves. That's what people say, no? Well, guess what? They never have to worry about putting food on table. Me and Shana take whatever we can get. She's probably running on neuro stims. Not worried? Hey, you can't have it all. And even if we did, nobody get off their ass and do anything. Well, when you put it that way. Now that that's over, you okay? Eh, don't worry about it. I've had worse. No good fucking deadbeats. Up till now, we almost got used to them. But to pull a knife on one of their own? Well, at least Shana can focus on her job now. No one in the family ever got as high up as her. Anyway, stop by whenever you're around. I throw in a nice discount for you. Sure thing, boss. Thanks. just came in. You're gonna break into the SciTech factory and steal some designs belonging to a certain Rihanna Kumar. Surprise, surprise, clients Kumar herself. I'm guessing you'll need to wrap your head around this one, so be sure to scan the deeds.
Like this, I think to myself, shit, am I glad I got B. Keep up the framework. Closing the gig. at a homeless camp. Send you the info I have so far, but it's pretty thin. You probably already gathered it's a cyber psycho. Oh, and I prefer if he didn't die.
be damned. I know you. Saw you back at the Aldecaldo camp. They call you V, right? The one and only. Did someone from the family send you here? Here by pure chance. No one sent me. Why? Is this the kind of place I'm supposed to be? Carol and Cass are here to close the deal with the scavengers. We purloined some cyberware for them. And? And it's taken them near eternity. Something isn't right. I'll go and take a look. Make sure everything's okay. Wait, wait. It's just... Well, they could get real sore about... Just keep a lookout. Sorry to interrupt. How's it going? Close the deal yet? V, what are you doing here? Who is this? Thought I'd drop by, you know. Make sure everyone's playing fair. Who the fuck is this? They call me V. I don't give an ass like fuck what they call me. What are you trying to pull here, huh? This some kind of scare tactic? Simmer down now. He's with us. Can you count the fucking three? One? Two, three! That's how many you're supposed to be! Even money was also supposed to be here. But I can't see any. How about we get this over with, Roman? We were late. Our bad, granted. We'll scratch off 10%. 20. 15. Fine, let's call it a fucking day already. I'll give the sick for the edges. You must be outside your mind, V. Why do you come here? Bumped into your man outside. Said it was taking too long, so I figured I'd take a look. Save as you're patronizing, V. We knew the risk, but... We really need this money. Like, badly. Hush up now! You can conversate all you want later. Didn't like your ugly skin plate from the get-go. Now I know why. You're the one who flushed us out in Watson. Sandra Dorset. Thought we'd forget, huh? We're done here. Now, now. That had nothing to do with the Alicaldos. Said you were all together, yeah? Am I right? Or did I fucking hear wrong? Okay, but... Oh no. We're... Why do you think they had a sniper? It would have ended up like this anyway. Maybe. Never find out now, will we? Let's not get torn up now. You hear? You never know if your bad luck has spared you from worse luck. You charged into the lion's den to help us, V. Why? Because you listened to your heart. That's a rare thing. Especially out here. 
Some things, money just can't buy. Speaking of money, can't just leave it sitting around. Thanks for everything, V. So long, now. a serious gig, which means I'll be needing a serious merc. I want you to hop to 6th Street turf and graft a virus onto their tech. Counting on you, champ. Oh, and one last thing. There's this techie, Lucius Thorin. And I wouldn't mind if he got a piece of lead to the skull. You dig? Good. Specs attached. Ain't the America I fought for. Every Don't be soft. Upgrade. Play gorilla now. Come on, don't crack me now.
listening to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan, and this is the latest from around the world. The lunar Rimskaya uranium mine collapse that occurred just outside Novosibirsk in southern Siberia has concluded with a happy ending. As you recall, 35 miners became trapped deep underground following a high-magnitude earthquake. I'll give you a real war! sliding their gunk asses anywhere near my turf again. And that thing with Lucia Stora? <laughs> Cherry on top. Contract galost. shitload of beta acid stolen. What's beta acid, you might wonder? Fuck if I know, but it's worth a lot, and our client wants it back. That's where you come in. Iron at the ready. More info attached. I just gotta wait. Huh? Bill Jablonski. Mm. Did Okada give you the details? My info is I'm supposed to off someone. No, not just anyone. Joshua Stevenson, a fucking murderer. I'll tell you more inside. Get in. You're driving. They're supposed to pass down this street. We just sit tight till they show up and follow them. I want to see the light in that motherfucker's eyes go out. Whoa. Why? so he can smell his own fear before he dies. Want him dead why, exactly? That's not your concern. Rather know what I'm getting into. Stevenson murdered my wife. They convicted him, put him on death row. But the slime bag found a get-out-of-jail-free card over my dead fucking body. Wait, Stevenson won't be alone? Could have prepared better knowing that. No one else needs to die today, only him. Who's his entourage? They gonna be packing? Ordinary people. Once we scare them, let them know we're serious, they won't lift a finger. How do you define ordinary? Corpo rats who got him out of the can. They'd sell their own mothers to save their own skins. Just don't fire at them. Plan sounds half-baked. Honestly, don't like it. What's that supposed to mean? First up, don't execute in public, don't need an audience. Second, they could get away. You don't get it. I spent my life savings on this. That's them! Step on it!
goddamn car! Fuck! Brake, I said! Brake! This is it. Let's go. Stay close. I'm gonna blow the motherfucker to bits myself. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna fucking kill him! NCPD! Stop right there! Lieutenant Vasquez, NCPD! Stop right there! You're protecting a murderer! Drop it or I shoot! Wait! No, stop! Stop the killing! They're here to kill you! It's not their fault. Shoot the guy, and our deal is dead. Vasquez! Shoot! Right! Let's just all shoot holes at each other! Loud. Fuck! We can't leave him here. Media vultures will be here any minute. What the fuck are you doing? Stop! NCPD! Stay where you are and get that goddamn semi out of here! We take him with us. What? You, wa Olga, you want me to come with you? <laughs> I need you. You're out of your fucking mind. Hey, another word from you, and I am calling the studio. Gregor, don't make me ruin your career. Busted hit on my guy. Nobody, and yeah. I mean One nobody, cat. will harm Build up hair here. on your head. No priors, but run a just, just, uh, just to be sure. Borrowing you. Thanks, I owe you. No patrol car, and stay off the frequencies too. Can't have this coming back. What the hell is this? <laughs> What's your name? This. What a fucking V. Josh Davis. But you fucking listen to me. Fucking listen. You are associate. We're clear to go. What the boys in the precinct will mop up here. Bill Jablonski. Ring a bell? Sadly, yes. Teach us to number our days that we may gain a heart of wisdom. Wait a sec. You're V. I heard of you. Can't say the same about you. We can't take him. Out of the question. He's way too big a threat. Well, I want to give him a job. Christ on a stick. Finally, something that isn't a complete snore fest. Could binge watch this all day if I had some popcorn. You gonna tell me what it is you want from me? Well, this one time Rachel is right. We can't stay here. Come with us. You'll find out all you need to know on the way. Gotta object, strongly. Noted. But you don't have a Ha! <laughs> That's it. Got no fucking idea what this is about. But if you don't go with them, I'm never talking to you again. All right. I'll go with you. Uh, move it! We're running late! Have you ever experienced anything that changed the meaning of existence? Changed your life? Could say that. Sure. Then you will understand exactly what I'm trying to do. Twelve years ago, I was sentenced to prison for armed robbery. And other sins. I shot and killed several people in cold blood, and it didn't mean anything to me at the time. But behind bars, you get all the time in the world to think. And I thought to correct the errors of my ways. Why'd you shoot him? I was holding a gun. I didn't like the way they looked at me, and I had the power to stop them. I still see their faces just before... <clears throat> ...frozen in time. God, give me strength to never forget. I still don't get why you're telling me this. I want you to understand what I am about to do. Spill already. What do you want from me? Stay with me for the day. And I'll pay you what you were promised to kill me. Uh, excuse me? With what money? Not mine. The studio's. And the studio will pay. The 
Still got no idea what it is you want from me. Remain by my side and talk to me. That's it. Don't like Rachel. She's got the gift of the gab, surely. I'm merely a springboard for her career. <laughs> a high-value asset. You're the one I want to talk to. Just till the end of the day. Till the end of the day. I sense anything going wrong, I'm out. No one will force you to stay. We're almost at Gloria LMR's. Give me a moment, I need to prepare. Vasquez, keep an eye on them. I'm gonna stay in the car. Keep it short. We're on a tight schedule. Zuleika? You're... late. I... found a companion... along the way. Someone from the studio? Do you remember what you wrote me in your last letter? He is everything you spoke of. V. Meet Zuleika. V. Pleasure. Mm. You are a friend of Joshua's? Recent acquaintance, more like. <sighs> Mama isn't back yet. We can talk inside until she returns. Uh, come in. Hurry up. I'll be waiting outside. Looks like someone doesn't enjoy waiting patiently. Fuck off! Please, sit down. Can I offer you anything? A drink? A uh, glass of water. Please. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, one God. Amen. Zuleika is the sister of the man I killed. She wrote me letters while I was doing time. That is how we two were united. Through forgiveness. You're the reason Joshua found redemption. It was her letter that started everything. I lost a brother. God gave me another. It's not every day you run into a true believer in Night City. It was Providence that brought you under my roof. We met because of him. Tell me, V. Do you believe in God? For all I know, there could be a higher power out there. But nobody's been able to prove it. No one ever will. Faith is something no one but you can prove. Zuleika and I have a, a running dispute. I was thinking you could help us resolve it. 
No, no. I never agreed to anything like this. I'm all ears. Joshua, he... He thinks he's the Messiah and wants to end his own life. That is not true. I never said I was any sort of Messiah. Suicide? Do you really think that's what the Lord could ever want from you? It won't be suicide. What exactly is going on here, Josh? When the media learned I'd found God in prison, the next day my face was on the cover of every screen sheet. A brain dance studio took notice. They sent representatives to make me an offer. <laughs> Bloodsuckers. I was facing the electric chair. Now, with the studio's help, my death will be more than a state-sanctioned murder. They want to scroll a brain dance of Joshua being crucified. An execution like any other, just garbed in holy robes. Why the brain dance? What, what's in it for you? Zuleika transformed me into a child of God. It's time I repaid that debt. I want to bear witness to love's existence in a manner that all the lost souls on this wretched earth can understand. Why love? If unconditional love exists, then so must God. It's time the world was reminded of his divine presence. Think of the millions jacked into their feeds like livestock. The children growing up in gang-infested streets. Do they know love? Think of the joy toys on Jig Jig Street. Coked out corpos in their offices, and murderers who stalk the streets. I want to reach them. I will reach them. And think of paid killers like you, V. Have you known love? Do you know what it is? Mother's home. Joshua Stevenson. We meet again. And who are you? My name is V. Go. You are not welcome here. Mrs. El Amar. I have come to beg you for forgiveness. You... You murdered my son. That is something I can never forgive. I truly do regret the pain I have caused you. Out of my house, no! Just go, please. Out, all of you! We should leave, really. Please, Mrs. Elamar! Murderer! It's okay, just go. You took my Reuben from me. My child, my son. Let's go back to the car. I just wish I could have talked to Gloria and explained everything. And somehow I thought... I, I thought she'd find it in her heart to forgive me. Time to grab a bite to eat. Where are we eating? Uh, Pie Z. They do a great cup of coffee. Got a killer cheesecake at Pie Z. I'm lactose intolerant. How about vegan avocado ice cream, then? How well do you know the city? Why does it matter? I'm just curious. Happen to like it out here is all. 
can't know Night City well, ever. It's always changing, always surprising. Part of its charm. Hmm, <laughs> true that. Take Stevenson inside, grab us all a table. Need a word with our stowaway here. Mm. Wait up a sec, I wanna talk. So, what do you think about our next big BD star? Time's Eddie's V. Honestly, can't rightly make my mind up about him. Let me help you out. Stevenson's a very disturbed man whose obsession with guilt is driving him to the brink of insanity. If he's as crazy as you say, why is he so important to you? Because Stevenson's got a little something that's in short supply, but in very high demand. That little something's called authenticity. And that brain, composed entirely of cat shit at this point, he truly believes what he says. Huh. Sounds like the perfect BD actor. Mm-hmm. And one incapable of fucking up in any way. Stevenson could be a fat old fucking gold vein for our studio. And that's my concern because... You're fucking with his mind, asking probing questions. You're making him doubt, and most importantly, jeopardizing my investment. So I'm prepared to pay you double what he's promised you to quietly walk away. Don't do it, V. My answer's no. Why do I think you don't understand what I'm offering you? Understand just fine. Let's go inside. Not bad for a petty mark off the streets. Grown curious how this will all end. In pain and profit, that's how. One's sacred, the other's insane. But who knows if they aren't congruous concepts. But yeah, I'm curious too. And I've been surprised before. mouth, Vasquez. Got a tough customer with that Vasquez. Even for a badge. He is set in his ways. Like so many men. Feeling tired? Bored? Not Vasquez. He blew inside and out. Might as well have been born with a badge. You must have some solid dirt on him, then. And the studio majority stakeholders a corp. Unlike you, Vasquez would clearly mind having enemies in high places. This brain dance. I'm curious. Tell me more. Title's the passion. We're speaking to the LCD, of course. And it's gonna revolutionize BD. How so? Well, Stevenson's furlough is only so long, we can only scroll the last bit with him. But we'll fill in the run-up to the finale with BD doubles and Nemo Bank assets. It'll feel like Stevenson, though. How's that even possible? Give me a break. We're part of EBM. Infinite investment in tech. Couple of years and we won't be using actors anymore. 
My dream of the day. So why Josh? Sounds like you don't even need him now. The son of man's agony. You can't leave it strictly out of digital threads just yet. And you? Get any say in all this? He forced the writers to go with the Christian gospel according to Luke. They'd originally opted for John. Guess that's, uh, important for... John's version is crude and over the top. The Gospel of Luke speaks more to my sensibility. Besides, Luke's Christ is prepared for what awaits him. I want the world to understand that. Feel it. You sound like an actor who really wants to become the part. I only have one shot at this. I, I need to make a count. You really believe you're like Jesus? I... I believe we should all follow his example. Chatter's pointless. That's enough. Stevenson can't be distracted. He has to focus now. Relax, Rachel. Yes, why... I don't know anything about you. How do you spend your leisure time? What do you do to unwind? None of your fucking business. I mean it as a serious question. I meditate. Didn't take you for one with the spiritual side. You being... Well... You. Know what your problem is, all of you? You refuse to understand that spirituality can only ever be personal. And why the fuck are you here anyway? For the free meal? I'll tell you exactly why. No! I I don't give the slimmest shit what you have to say. Ugh, all this talk about grace and salvation and transformation. I could puke. Take it from a beady producer. Religion's an elaborate lie. All of them. But, Rachel. No, we're done for the day. Finish your meal, we'll put you up at the studio. And you, get lost. I'll get your fee soon. Goodbye, V. I am truly glad to have met you. Props. Really well played, Dad. What do you make of it all? Guy just might be the biggest nut job I've ever seen. But it's still corporate exploitation. Your cynicism is starting to wear thin on me. We could talk in circles, but who cares what we think? What would it change? Corpse will continue to grow rich off his type, and the masses will live on with their pipe dreams. Hang on, where's Rebel Johnny? Seemed to have lost him. Well, I found him. He's inside that guy. He's the real Rebel. Make up your mind, which is it? Nut job or Messiah? He's fucked in the head. The world's fucked in the head, and you're fucked in the head because my fucked up head is inside it. Guess if you want to save the world, that's the first step. Get fucked in the head. Ten casinos, five poles, what do you think? God exists? Fuck, kill me, please. Come on, serious question. What? Why? So you flatlined, then got your beat back. Don't tell me that's left you wondering if a construct can even be saved. You're gonna tell me you don't think about being a digital psyche. Possible consequences thereof. Really? I mean, are you already dead? Or alive till the last existing digi-ghost of you is shredded? Meaning like, am I gonna ascend to digi-heaven? Ascend to digi-hell's more likely. But yeah. There is life after death. The silver hand already live in the afterlife, and I'm talking to his animated epitaph. I don't give it an ounce of thought. Surprise. To me, I'm just that. Me. No nether world, no happy wonder world. Just duped digital psyches. Weird as fuck today. Just kind of unreal. But. Reality beckons. Come on, we got places to trash. <laughs>